Thank you for joining Wars of the Roses. And this is Medals from the Encyclopedia Freemasonry by Albert G. Mackey. Medals. A medal is defined to be a piece of metal in the shape of a coin bearing figures or devices and mottos struck and distributed in memory of some person or event. When Freemasonry was in its operative stage, no medals were issued. The medals of the operative Masons were the monuments which they erected in the form of massive buildings adorned with all the beauties of architectural art. But it was not long after its transformation into a speculative order before it began to issue medals. The earliest Masonic medal of which we have an authentic account is that known as the Freemason's Ducat, which was struck at Brunswick in 1743. The number have since so greatly increased that it would be impossible to give even a catalogue of them. Medals are now struck every year by lodges to commemorate some distinguished member or some remarkable event in the annals of the lodge. Many lodges in Europe have cabinets of medals of which the Lodge Minerva of the Three Palms at Leipzig is especially valuable. In America, such a collection has been made by Pythagoras Lodge at New York. Figure one, Penny of the Markmaster. No Masonic medal appears to have been found earlier than that of 1733, commemorative of a lodge being established at Florence by Lord Charles Sackville. The lodge appears not to have been founded by regular authority, but however that may be, the event was commemorated by a medal, a copy of which exists in the collection in possession of the Lodge Minerva of the Three Palms at Leipzig. The adversa contains a bust representation of Lord Sackville with the inscription, Carol's Sackville Magister. The reverse represents Harpocrates in the attitude of silence, leaning upon a broken column and holding in his left arm the cornucopia filled with rich fruits. Also the implements of Freemasonry with a thyrsus staff and serpent resting upon the fore and background. The thyrsus, by the way, being a staff wreathed in ivy or vine leaves and crowned with a pine cone or a bunch of ivy leaves, the Bacchic wand or rod, borne by the Bacchants, priests or votaries of the rites of Bacchus. The minimum of charity found among mark masters is the Roman penny, the denarius, weighing 60 grains silver worth 15 cents. See mark master's wages. The coin shown in figure one was struck at Rome under Tiberius 18 AD. The portrait is Tiberius. The reverse, the goddess clemency. The Latin inscription reads in English, Tiberius Caesar Augustus, the son of the deified Augustus, the high priest. Two medals, weighing 120 grains each of silver, about 30 cents, were struck off at Jerusalem under Simon Maccabee, the Jewish ruler, 138-139 BC. They are the oldest money coined by the Jews. The devices are the brazen lava that stood before the temple and three lilies springing from one stem. The inscriptions translated from the Hebrew of the oldest style say, half shekel, Jerusalem the holy, Brother Rob Morris and Brother Coleman in their calendar furnish much valuable information on this subject. The earliest work on Masonic medals is by Ernest Zacharias, entitled Pneumotheca Numismatica Lato Morum. It was issued at Dresden in parts, the first appearing on September 13, 1840, the eighth and last on January 29, 1846. It gave 48 medals in all. Then came Dear Denkmeinzen der Freimaurer Bruderschaft by Dr. J.F.L. Theodor Merzdorf, published at Oldenburg in 1851 and describing 334 medals. A standard work on the subject is The Medals of the Masonic Fraternity by W.T.R. Marvin, privately printed at Boston in 1880, in which over 700 medals are described. Figure two, Jewish half shekels of silver, two specimens. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to share, like, subscribe and comment. And if you can, please consider donating to Wars of the Roses. Links to PayPal and Patreon are in the description. Thank you so very much.